Right now you're into Urban Mix. Make sure you stay in tune with the best. All right, you're still watching Urban Mix and this your boy Prince, always looking fresh, looking clean. As I always say, why do I repeat myself? Because I know I'm looking clean, I'm looking fresh. Thank you for always watching the show. These videos are all massive. Keep supporting African entertainment. Keep supporting Urban Mix. Go on YouTube, Urban Mix TV, right here. After you watch me, finish, you're done on this channel. Please, wherever you're watching me, subscribe to the channel on YouTube. It's Urban Mix TV. On Urban underscore Mix, that is Instagram. And on Facebook, it's Urban Mix Live. All right, you're still watching Urban Mix. Your man Twitch is right here in the building. On the flip side, you're gonna see him and we're gonna have a beautiful talk as we always do on Urban Mix. We're gonna dissect the stories and everything that has been in the system and the entertainment industry for all this week. So stay tuned. Your man Twitch is in the building. He's going to join me and we're going to have a beautiful conversation as we do always. This is Urban Mix and you're watching the show. Wherever you're watching me from, please, after you're done here on this channel, just go straight on YouTube. It's Urban Mix TV. See you on the flip side as Twitch join me in the studio. Right now you're into Urban Mix. Make sure you stay in tune with the best. You're still watching Ever Mix and always looking fresh, always giving you whatever is happening here on Urban Mix. What's up? What's happening? Last week, we had a great conversation and I mean, it was massive. The feedback that are coming in is like, yes, our views on the attack on Kevin Boy and everything was massive. A lot of people have issues with us, but anyway, we have our views, they have their views, yeah. but anything they say, well, listen. So, I mean, yeah, it was a great conversation. How was everything since last week? I mean, let's see what I was um, Everything has been great. Everything is going on cool. Like, everything is just normal, as usual it is, same day. And how's the feeling on Urban Mix? I mean, coming on Urban Mix, how's the feedback and everything so far with the discussion with friends? I mean, how is it going so far? Uh, with Urban Mix, like coming up here doing this interview and all that stuff like it's been great like everybody has been talking about it my friends especially and like getting new people coming in has been making everything look like yeah. commenting and everything so i guess as far as we are keeping on going keeping on delivering and everything i think we're gonna be great all right if you're watching us in this your boy prince with twitch in the building that's what i'm talking about it's always fresh how was the Independence Day celebration? I mean, as an American, how was it? American, African, or American, Ghanaian, or I don't know. Oh, it's how was Ghanaian. the celebration like? Uh, the 4th of July yep. was great. Yesterday was super great. Like, you can hear all the fireworks everywhere. Everywhere. Especially my neighbors. Oh, my goodness. They disturbed a lot. I liked it. I just like the sound of fireworks. I don't know. It just makes me feel so happy, especially when like you can see everything it's right in front of you, blowing up and everything looking great. They made a lot of noise with the fireworks from, I think, 7 till so, 1 p.m., 1 a.m. the next day. Like, I was like, whoa, they bought a lot of fireworks, but I enjoyed it. So, I mean, it was great. looking at Ghana's independence and like the ones you've experienced back home in Ghana and Africa and comparing it to here and the way they do this, like here in the united states when they are celebrating their independence how is the difference can you compare whatever they, they do in oh yeah here in the, yeah in the i can compare states? it because i've experienced both of it with ghana independence day yep. it is full of entertainment having fun going to the club going to the beach after that partying with your friends here you can do that but here is more fireworks okay here is more of staying home unless you get one or two of your friends. And during this coronavirus times, you can't really do anything. So you just need to hang tight, do your fireworks at home or join one or two friends and have fun. So how, was the, how was the barbecue experience? I mean, a lot of families do barbecue. I mean, comparing it to Ghana, Ghana we don't- No, no, really no, we don't do, do barbecue. Much barbecue. We just but like here, looking at the previous years, let's say last year's Independence Day and this year Independence Day here in the United States, comparing it, the, the corona and no corona, how was it like? Uh, with the corona is difficult but compared to the other ones the previous one with no corona it has been best because you get a lot of people to come around you meet a lot of people barbecuing outside you have a lot of people having fun 
playing soccer, basketball, and all that. But with this corona, even yeah, even some of the state limited their fireworks. Yeah. Even uh, DC couldn't do their fireworks. A lot of states couldn't do their fireworks. I think New York did their fireworks, but they still need to have the social distancing. Because like which is firework bad. is the most important thing in the in, in the Fourth of July. Yeah. In because the like it's the biggest. You see a lot of people line up on the roadside just waiting for the fireworks just time but this time around like you just have to stay at home watch your thing on your tv or some corners like i mean anyway if you don't know that but you know that a lot of people didn't know that okay so united states also like had an independence like no this is how it happened so after the colonies formed the uh, state and all it was yeah. originally 13 states 13 13 states so this was what happened all the 13 states came together from the United States, but still they have to pay their taxes to, to the queen, who was still ruling over all the states. Then we're like, no, why are we paying all these taxes? We are doing our own thing. The Britain don't bring us anything. They all take our money, they take our taxes and everything. No, this time around, we don't want the ruling of the queen. You stay in England and take our money. The Britain army was here fighting over everything but they fought and fought and fought until time that okay the queen decided to just give them their own independence let's go straight in entertainment i mean corona is still slowing entertainment down as last week you were here talking about the postponement of the ghana music awards usa it's happening today which is today yeah. saturday it's happening in ghana let's talk about it how is it going to happen is it going to be they are going to bring people there or is it still going to be virtual the nominees announcement how is it going to happen let's talk about that because i know it's happening today live on coffee tv and on joy prime and yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. All that, a lot all that, of tv a lot of tv TV yeah. uh, uh, stations so how is it going to happen uh so we're still doing the virtual stuff okay we're still doing as everybody is doing yeah. we don't want to put anybody in any problem Probably, yeah. yeah we don't want anybody to get the virus so we are still doing the virtual, the virtual. everybody should just stay home relax in your own couch get some drinks and so watch it's how after you are it done is. watching urban mix just log on just on, watch on, it on, just log on 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 internet go to coffee tv you can just have all the live views and if you don't want to miss it come to urban mix urban mix tv we're going to show it so go on on facebook right now it's going to be urban mix live we're going to have the link over there we're going to share with you guys so if you've not subscribed to it and you want to watch the virtual show right now just go after you are done watching here you can even pause it right now and go and just download it <laughs> if you don't have facebook just download it if you don't have instagram download it but i don't think nobody has instagram at this time at this age so instagram? they have it yeah you don't have instagram on your phone like oh i do i do have instagram but i'm some... talking about some people don't have instagram. oh yeah some people don't have instagram okay so if you don't have it and you're still enjoying the show on this channel please just go ahead download instagram <laughs> download facebook and download youtube you can find us on all social media platforms Let's talk about mostly what is what is happening in Ghana. I mean, the coronavirus is there, but people are still doing events. Oh, yeah. Just last weekend, they had the EMY African Award. How do you call that award? EMY? Yes. Emmy? It's not, they say it's not Emmy Awards. It's EMY African Awards. I mean, they, no, they, no, no. How can it be EMY with no full stop in between it? If, it's, if, if, that means so every, we, every, every letter has it meaning it meaning okay. so you need to so it's not a make it of yeah like okay. it's it's just a word amy okay so amy african award so that is that is if you want us to call it like that but it was it was nice i watch a lot of a lot of visuals mm. coming all the way i mean everyone makes was still yeah. around getting some red carpet pictures i mean as you can see on your screen it was beautiful but how do you see it are people still not taking the precautions of organizing an event, even though there are issues out there with all this? This was not virtual. People attended the event. How do you see, I mean, coronavirus and event happening in Ghana? I mean, it was a nice show anyway. Yeah, it was a nice, it was, it was really nice. Yeah. But the thing is, I think it all depends on the organizers. Okay. It is what the organizers are going to tell the people. Okay. That is going to make the people come, come out. Okay. So with the amy okay or emy, EMY. awards yeah let's take it like that emy okay. i don't even understand it but 
So with the EMY African Awards, African Awards, okay. the organizers made them come. Okay. Is it is it okay for organizers to still bring people? What I want to find out with this award is, is it still okay for organizers to still bring out people? Or, I mean, people have to be responsible to themselves, even though the organizers are still having an event. Okay, uh, it depends on the organizers and it depends on how the rate of the coronavirus is going. Okay. Before in Ghana, the rate was going high. That is why everything was not going good. But to now I think the some of it have dropped, like the rate is going down okay. and the recoveries are getting high. Oh, yeah. okay. So that means the possibility of letting people come out and interact with each other is high because everything is limited right now. So I think that is why the organizers okay. thought about it. Okay, I think now the corona, the rate is going down so we can still come out. We haven't seen each other for a while. But I think it, it was good. I like it. I like how the presentation and everything went, the red carpet and everything. But I think still, they could have taken some one or two precautions and but, I mean, looking but at some of the outfit and stuff like that, people are still wearing masks, people are wearing face shields. So, I mean, I think people are, yes, they want to go out, but they just don't want to go out just like that. I mean, people are putting yeah. fashion to the face mask, face shield. I mean, looking at the pictures rolling on the screen. So yes, I think so far it was nice. Looking at the winners, Zion Felix won the best communicator of the year. Uh, how do you how do you see this award? I mean, Zion has been one of the most controversial bloggers in Ghana, and winning this award, I mean, yes, but do you see it to be more of yes, he deserve it or no? I think he deserve it. Okay, because I've seen Zion Felix all over everything. Yeah, I mean, uh, I've seen Zion Felix in part of uh, Ghana, Ghana Music Award USA, yeah. Yeah. and I've seen what he has been doing, going up and down, blogging and all that, posting his YouTube as a massive fan, daily, like, delivery of videos and all that, bringing, so yeah, he, he, like, he is the new... The new guy out here. Yes, so if he's the new guy, then he deserves it. I mean, he's not a like... new guy. He has been doing blogging for a long time. Yeah. With Amir um, Debra Adams and all this guy from way back. But you see, about, everything, this is season, right? Yeah, everything has time. Okay. Right now, you're into Urban Mix. Make sure you stay in tune with the best.